An airline redesigns its cabins to offer a fully connected flight. An iconic hotel offers millennials a fresh new brand. And what brand wins as most liked in Super Bowl commercials? This is BizWire TV, where your news is made. Erin is off. I'm Melanie Kapadia. Top of the wire this week. Big brands invest in connecting the customer. JetBlue announced a fully connected in-seat experience when it restyles its Airbus A320 cabin starting early next year. The airline says look for free gate-to-gate Wi-Fi or Fly-Fi as they call it. Also plan new 10-inch HD screens with Android-based streaming entertainment systems, in-seat power outlets and USB ports for personal devices. JetBlue says this will be the first interior redesign of the A320 fleet since it launched in 2000. Hilton's new mid-scale brand also focuses on connecting the customer. The hospitality company announced True by Hilton, designed to appeal to a younger or young-minded audience. Hilton says all the hotels will have a technically forward mentality with free Wi-Fi, mobile check-in and digital keys. Features also include the Hive, described as a first-floor experience divided into zones for work, play, lounge, and eating. And efficient rooms with platform beds, 55-inch TVs, and spacious bathrooms. True by Hilton will debut at the end of 2016. And connected devices top quick biz hits. Amazon has announced the first products that are now available with Amazon Dash Replenishment. These are connected devices that automatically reorder supplies from Amazon when they're running low. The first out of the gate include Brother printers that order toner or ink and a GE washing machine with smart dispense technology. Coming soon, Whirlpool smart appliances and Brita water pitchers that order more filters. Olo is expanding its dispatch delivery service. The New York-based company powers mobile, online and phone ordering for large chain restaurants such as Noodles and & Company and Five Guys. Olo just received $40 million from the Rain Group. The funding will fuel the service that gives restaurants the ability to offer home delivery using a network of providers. And you can see the news delivered. Our Nuvi social media monitor tracked the story reaching more than 17 million people worldwide. In other Nuvi top trenders, more than 82 million people tuned in on social media when Starbucks announced it is teaming up with music streaming service Spotify. The deal gives Starbucks mobile app users the ability to immediately discover music that's playing overhead at thousands of its coffee shops. The companies say customers will be able to save the Starbucks curated playlist and listen to it anywhere. <laughs> Easy, breezy, beautiful. CoverGirl. CoverGirl reached more than 32 million glam fans through Tumblr, Twitter and Instagram with the news that Zendaya is the new face of easy, breezy, beautiful CoverGirl. The cosmetic company says the actress-singer brings her own signature swag and is redefining standards of what it means to be authentic. Who's that? You must be new. That is Bruce Wayne. And the buzz is building for the release of Batman vs Superman Dawn of Justice. More than 5 million people were reached when Warner Brothers Consumer Products Division announced its worldwide licensing and merchandising program. Just a few of the many global licensees include toys from Mattel and the Lego Group and apparel from BioWorld and Under Armour. The spotlight is on education for National School Choice Week. Organizers say the annual event's goal is to raise parents' awareness of the best education options for children in grades K through 12. More than 16,000 events took place across the country, all independently planned by local schools, organizations, homeschool groups, and chambers of commerce. Finally, countdown to Super Bowl 50, and of course, all the new Super Bowl commercials. But what are the most liked ads that brands should aspire to? They're Budweiser's Puppy Love from 2014, followed by its 2013 tearjerker, Brotherhood. I took my love, took it down. Climbed a mountain and I turned around. These are the fan favorites according to Ace Metrics, a company that measures the impact of video advertising. It has released the 25 most liked Super Bowl ads of the last five years. Budweiser's ads featuring puppies and its Clyde sales helped the brand lead the pack with six of the top commercials. Doritos bagged five favorites, including Sling Baby from 2012. Be sure to catch BizWire TV every Friday, the Accelerator Report on Sundays, and check out more top news anytime at businesswire.com.